it will help us be able to provide more service and improve service to our customers. If you ride the bus, you could soon see your fare go up. That's because Valley Regional Transit, which runs the public bus system throughout the Treasure Valley, is considering its first fare increase in nearly two decades. So what's behind it? And what do people think about it who ride the bus? KTVB's Shira Matsuzawa is here with some answers. Yeah, you know, the last time we saw a rate hike in Ada County was back in 2003. But before this proposed increase can happen, Valley Regional Transit wants to hear from you. Hold tight, riding the bus could soon cost you more. It's hard enough as is to come up with the uh, fares. I guess it's doable, but I really would prefer not to. <laughs> I love the buses because it makes it a lot easier and less traffic. On Wednesday afternoon, 72-year-old Heidi was waiting for the bus near Boise Town Square Mall. I used to live in California and I yeah, used to take the bus to downtown LA. This, though, was her first time riding it in Idaho. And it comes as Valley Regional Transit is considering a proposal that would increase single ride fares up to 50%. So we're talking about the single ride, a base fare, 50%. So from a dollar to a dollar fifty. Multi-use passes, meaning day, monthly, and annual passes, would also go up between 10 and 25%, depending on the pass. We are doing these fare increases because it's been 16 years since we had one, and in that time we've. We've added a bunch of things that to help improve the service uh, f for riders. Services like fixed bus stops and real-time information about where buses are. I barely have enough to ride the bus today. <laughs> Asia works at the mall and doesn't drive. So for her, the bus is her main source of transportation, and every cent makes a difference. I just don't think that would be fair because the people that take the bus usually can't afford, you know, rides and stuff, so increasing it would be kind of silly. It adds up real quick. For Heidi, though, the fair hike is necessary. And dollar fifty is beautiful because uh, it's better than gas and parking and accidents and insurance. I think that's the best thing. But before Valley Regional Transit does anything, they want to hear from you. We're asking the public to let us know how that change might impact their, their commuting and their life. Now, once Valley Regional Trans Transit gets that public input, they'll then take it to the executive board in July, and then their full board will make a decision in August. Now, D, if approved, it'll go into effect October 1st. That's the size of the increase share. Is there a chance that they might consider a different, you know, type of percentage increase rather than that up to 50%? You know, it varies. So for the single ride increase, that's it's 50%. It kind of sounds like it's a done deal as long as this gets approved. Um, but then for the other multi-passes, it'll be a smaller increase. So, uh, you know, only time will tell if it gets passed or not. And I guess we'll have to wait till August. Keep an eye on it, Shira. Thank you. 